reveal. I'm so sad I can't do that anymore. I want to do more face reveals. I just recorded this whole video without sound, so we're doing it again. Hey guys, it's Sandy, and in today's tutorial, I'm going to be showing you this super cute strawberry manicure that's been dipped into chocolate. Yeah, that's all you do. You just paint a strawberry on your nail, and then you dip them into chocolate. No, I'm kidding. Don't do that. That would be crazy. But what's really cool about this manicure is the drizzle chocolate is 3D, so it actually looks like real chocolate, and it smells like real chocolate. Guys, seriously, it smells like real chocolate. And I'm gonna show you how you can do all of this just by using nail polish. So stay tuned and I'll show you how I did it. Wait a second, I have something super exciting to share with you guys before we get into the tutorial. I just launched my first app for the iPhone and for Android and it's completely free and it has all of my Q Polish video tutorials on there. And it has a recreations page for you guys to come on and share your recreations with me and with everyone else who has the app. And you guys have already found this app. You guys are amazing. You've already found it and you've already been sharing your recreations, which is awesome. And also there's a tips and tricks page, so I have some cool DIY tools for you guys, hand positioning tips, how to paint with your other hand, things like that. So I really hope you guys enjoy this app. If you want to give it a try, you want to check it out, I have the links down below for you guys. If you download it, let me know what you think of it. And now let's get back to the tutorial. And now back to voiceover. Chocolate covered strawberries is one of my favorite treats. They're so fun to make and super delicious to eat. What's one of your favorite treats? Let me know down in the comments. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to paint these sweet little treats on your nails. The drizzle will be 3D and they will smell like actual chocolate. So let's begin. Start off by painting all of your nails with a base coat and then choose a strawberry red polish to paint your nails with. Red polishes are almost always very opaque, so you may be able to get away with just one coat for this design. Next, choose a bright green polish and use a toothpick to draw on some leaves coming down from your cuticle. Don't think too much about it, just draw a few random triangles coming down from your cuticle. Then use a stippling motion to fill in the leaves. Make sure the red underneath is fully dry or you will be bringing that color up from the nail and mixing it into the leaves. Now it's time for a bright yellow polish. Use this to add random small dots over the red for seeds. No need to worry if some dots are a little bigger than others, it just makes it look more natural. It's time for the chocolate. Choose a chocolate brown polish and paint the tip of your nail with it. The easiest way to do this is by keeping your brush still and slowly turning your finger to cover the entire tip of the nail. Give that a couple minutes to dry, and then, if you really want the 3D effect to be prominent, you will want to apply your top coat now. If not, you can do it after, and the nails will definitely dry faster, but the 3D effect will be lessened. However, it will still be there and it will still have a texture. Now it's time for my favorite part, the white chocolate drizzle. I'm using a special polish by Color Club that smells like white chocolate when it's dry. If you don't have this, you can always just opt for a regular white polish. To do the 3D drizzling, you will need to place a small puddle of white polish onto some tin foil and allow it to dry for about 15 to 20 minutes. We want it to become stringy. Keep checking to see when it's done. It will look really stringy like this when it's ready. Then just use a toothpick to string the polish over the tip of your nail. I like to push all of the polish from the puddle over to one side when it's ready to string. I find that this really helps. And that's it! Just give it some time to dry and you will have a super cute mani that's 3D and smells like chocolate. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more nail art videos. And if you give this design a try, then please share your recreations with me on Twitter and Instagram using the hashtag CutePolish. You can also share them on my new app as well. Take care and I'll see you next time!